Welcome to India Edu Tutorials. In our previous class, we taught you about binomial probability. Today, we would be discussing about some more complex examples. The question here says that if there are five multiple choice questions, then what is the probability that student will get five questions correct, at least four questions correct, no question correct, more than two questions correct, given probability of getting right answer is 0 0.25. So, here success would be probability of getting right answer and failure would be probability of getting wrong answer. It is given in the question that probability of getting right answer is 0 0.25. So probability of wrong answer would be 1 minus 0 0.25 which is equal to 0.75. The formula for binomial probability is nck p to the power k into q to the power n minus k. Our first part says 5 questions are correct. So, a formula becomes 5C5. N is equal to 5 because there are 5 multiple choice questions and K is also 5 because we need to check the probability of whether 5 questions are correct or not. And P is 0 0.25 to the power 5 into 0 0.75 to the power 5 minus 5. We get factorial 5 upon factorial 5 factorial 0 into 0 0.25 to the power 5 0 0.75 to the power 0 cancelling this we get 0 0.25 to the power 5 into 1 solve this and you will get 0 0.00098 as the answer let's move to the second part of the question. In the second part, it has been asked at least four questions are correct. So, for four questions, either four questions will be correct or five questions would be correct. Putting the values directly, we get 5C4.25 to the power 4 into 0.75 plus 5C5. 0.25 to the power 5 into 0.75 to the power 0. We get factorial 5 upon factorial 4 into factorial 1. 0.25 to the power 4 into 0.75 plus this will give us 1 into 0.25 to the power 5 into 1. Solving this factorial equation, we get 5 into 0.25 to the power 4 into 0.75 plus 0.25 to the power 5. Solve this equation and as a final answer we get 0 0.1563. Remember that while doing these questions the value of k will change. Other values will remain same. In the c part no question is correct. So here k will be 0. We get 5c0.25 to the power 0 into 0.75 to the power 5. Factorial 5 upon factorial 0 into factorial 5 into 1 into 0.75 to the power 5. Cancelling this we get 0.75 to the power 5. Solve this. And the final answer would be 0 0.23730. Last part of the question. Here it has been asked more than two questions are correct. More than two means probability of x equals to 3 plus probability of x equals to 4 plus probability of x is equals to 5. Putting values we get 5c3.25q 
into square of 0.75 plus 5c4 0.25 to the power 4 into 0.75 plus 5c5 into 0.25 to the power 5 into 0.75 to the power 0. We get factorial 5 upon factorial 3 into factorial 2 0.25 cube into square of 0.75 plus factorial 5 upon factorial 4 into factorial 1 into 0.25 to the power 4 0.75 plus factorial 5 upon factorial 5 into 0.25 to the power 5 into 1. Solving this factorial equation gives us 5 into 4, 20 by 2 into 0.25 power cube, 0.75 square plus 5 into 0.25 to the power 4, 0.75 plus 0.25 to the power 5. Solve this equation and I am giving the final answer which is 0.89648. Now let's have the another example. Our next question is probability that letter will be delivered anywhere in US is 2 days or less is 0.84. If a college graduate is sending job application to five and they are all due in two days then find the probability that four arrive within two days here success would be letter is delivered in two or less days and Failure would be not delivered in two or less days. Success is equal to here probability P, probability of success which is P is equal to 0.84. So Q would be 1 minus P which is equal to 0.16 that is 1 minus 0.84 number of trials is 5 because he sends 5 application so n is equal to 5 and k is equal to 4 because we need to find out probability of 4 k is equal to 4 putting these values in formula which is nc5 sorry nck p to the power k into q to the power n minus k gives us 5c4 p is 0.84 to the power 4 into q is 0.16 to the power 1 we get factorial 5 upon factorial 4 to factorial 1 to 0.84 to the power 4 0.16 this gives us 5 into 0.84 to the power 4 into 0.16 solve this equation and I'm getting to the final answer which is 0.3983 I hope you have understood these problems for more maths tutorials you can visit to indiaedu.com